Hello YouTube, Pat the Sound Guy here, your friendly neighborhood sound guy, with a new project. This little Craftsman tractor here, he's a little worse for wear, but we're going to fix him up a little bit more. He needs a tube in this tire, and we're going to show you how to do it, and how to get this wheel off with no torch. That's right, no torch. Stay tuned. Welcome back everyone. Let's get started on this little tractor here. First things first, a little safety talk. Please, when you do this kind of job, safety glasses, very important. Day. You're gonna be working with air tools here, so you don't wanna chip something off and take out an eye. You only get two eyes, well, so let's protect them. Please wear your safety glasses. And I recommend, cause I'm Pat the Sound Guy, I recommend ear protectors or ear plugs, cause these tools get loud. That out of the way, let's start by taking this little cap off. Of course, I'm sure many of you have seen the videos on how to take these caps off. It's very simple. Get your heat gun and heat it up. Get it good and soft. You may want to wear gloves. Not all that bad. Bring yourself a flathead screwdriver. Pull this little C-clip out. Now, of course, this guy does not want to come off. And, FYI, no amount of hammering is going to make that come off of there. So the next thing we've got now you can use the drill and make a little dimple on the end of that. But you don't need to. Normally you use a torch and you heat this up and then quench it and then you try and pull it off with the air hammer. But guess what? I figured out a lot of the time the air hammer is all that's necessary. So all you gotta do Center it on that shaft and give her and pull at the same time. Bam! Just like that. Not bad, eh? Those are about 20 bucks, maybe a little less. And if you got an air compressor, there you go. You don't need a whole torch set to try and heat that up. Sometimes you might, if it's on there hard enough, but there you go. Well, there we have it. Another job finished. I gotta go finish this one. Another two to put in the front tire to repeat the process. Thanks for watching, everyone. Please remember, click that subscribe button, comment down below, give a big old fat thumbs up, and we'll see you on the next one.